Hey you! Welcome to another sketchbook entry. My name is Laura, also known as Lazy Artist here on YouTube and on Instagram, and in this video I'm finally breaking in to this new sketchbook. This is the Stillman & Burton Beta Series sketchbook. It is hardcover, A4 size, and it has 26 sheets of cold-pressed 270 GSM white paper. The paper is also acid-free and good for both dry and wet media, including watercolors and ink. The paper has a soft tooth to it, just a slight texture that I really like, and the binding also seems sturdy, although it will have to be a bit forced since it was still stiff. I was only able to get the sketchbook from Jackson since you can find them here in Portugal, and I've had it on my shelf for quite some time now. But because I was still using another sketchbook when it arrived, I had to wait to use it. Because my main medium is watercolors, I wanted to purchase a good quality sketchbook this time and experiment with it. Some of my favorite artists had used this sketchbook, and so I wanted to give this one a try. Before jumping right onto the first page, I first flipped to the last one and did some swatching with different water ratios. The purpose of this is to get a sense of how the paper reacts to water and how vibrant the pigments of the watercolors are. One of the downsides of some watercolor sketchbooks is that their paper is one-sided. This means that you can paint on, on the front, but the back will not react as well with water. This was not the case. The swatches I made were in the back of the page, and the texture was fine as well as the way the paper reacted. After the little tests, I finally jumped onto the sketching. I'll be honest, I really liked sketching in this paper. Although it has a certain tooth to it, it isn't so harsh that drawing becomes hard. There was still some texture, but just enough to make sketching really enjoyable. I will now leave you with the painting process and speak to you in a while.
really enjoyed painting this paper. The water and the pigments flow beautifully on it. I also think the colors get really vibrant on the white paper. And I can't wait to create more in this sketchbook. Thank you so much for watching. Please like and comment, subscribe if you'd like, and I will see you in the next one. Take care!